I'm still waiting for the. I, I'm still maneuvering how much points things take. I got some expensive shit. Deku, yeah, you think about it. If I made it cheap, everybody would be just like slapping that button. So this is actually kind of funny because I, I mean, I got rid of most of my old PS1 stuff, but I kept a handful of the games that I, I wanted to keep, like, I kept all the Final Fantasies. I may lower the price to that though, Deku. I, I just... I was slapping prices on it because I didn't know what to put on it at first. And everybody keeps telling me that they get points at the ass, so... But anyway, so I kept my copy of, it was Final Fantasy Chronicles or something like that. What's that? Anyway. It, it, it was, it's a copy of Final Fantasy 4 and Chrono Trigger in one. Well, in a two disc set. And the PS3, even though it lost PS2 support, never lost PS1 support. So, it has some upscaling. I do have to fix that screen a little bit, though. Maybe not playing in the classic will give you an advantage. Ah, shut up. Chrono, Chrono. Good morning, Chrono. I gotta make the screen proper on the stream size. I noticed that it's kinda clipping it a bit. Come on, sleepyhead, get up! Ah, Lean's Bell makes such a beautiful music. Right, that's how I plan on playing the old wrestling game. I play the PS3. I mean, you still can as long as you get that cable. Get moving now. Okay. Now I can just bear with me for a second. I didn't have a whole lot of time for setup. as good as it's going to get. That reminds me, you said it works on PS3 also? Because when I looked it up on eBay, it said only compatible with PS2. Wait, hold on now. Okay, Deku, is the game audio louder than me? Like, by a bit? Before I, before I talk about that. I added one really expensive reward for shits and giggles. I don't think anyone will ever go for that one. <laughs> Alright, um, so here's the question. When you say... That reminds me, you said it works on PS3 also. 
because when I looked it up on the eBay... Yes! You mean the adapter, right? Finally, by the way, the inventor friend of yours. Uh, you know. Oh dear, I've forgotten her name. Okay, so the adapter is a PS2 adapter. The one I bought, it said it was a PS2 adapter. And I was like, I, I was actually taking a chance. It was more of an experiment to see if I could work this out. And I figured if it didn't work on my PS3 for the idea I had, because that port is supposed on the back of the PS3 is supposed to bypass that video, that video issue. Um, if it didn't work on my PS3, then I'd still have it if I ever wanted to plug my PS2 in and stream some games from that. But, lo and behold, you're seeing me use that exact cable I sent you. This is the PS3 right now. That's right, Lucia, don't forget, she invited you to see your new invention. Run along now, be back before dinner. Is that the last reward expensive because you're worried someone say to play Pokemon? That's that's one of the ideas. That that's I mean also to use that the people have to join the Discord too. Because that's where my list of games is. But yes, it could be something strange like that, and I, I do concern about that. And look through the world are places where you can save your game. PS3, you can do little things like this. You get this menu here, and controller side, where is it? Other settings. Screen, screen smoothing and full screen. It tries to stretch it without stretching the living death out of it. Yeah, go for it. I, I I was sitting there trying to... I finally sat down and tried to think of some ideas. And I, I never... I didn't get many, but I got a handful of them. Yeah, 20k is not that bad if it's a person who comes to watch your stream a lot. I should not have come in here. I, I don't even know what I'm doing. I'm supposed to be going to the fair. Stretching, yeah, yeah. 
like if it's not on here here here's an example uh, other settings full screen normal it's really not that bad because I think when the PS3 stretches it it changes the resolution too so it, it kind of makes it look more natural believe I'm doing this all over again. You're a true gentleman. My name is Err. I know, Deku. I'm not going to leave it like that, though. I'm not going to keep her named Err. Yeah, I definitely want to see what that looks like. back my cat. Thank you. You're so sweet, Chrono. <sighs> Ready for a rematch? Maybe I'll do a Let's Eat videos on YouTube and then see if there's interest and stuff like that. <laughs> I mean, if you're in a place that has a lot of different places you can visit, try different foods, that's not a horrible idea. Damn bomb. I won't beat this robot up to take my anger. Say, it took a minute there. <laughs> I think eight is the thing. You're going for eight. I don't know why. But... See, this is going to be the one issue. I'm using the actual disc. So you can kind of... 
I mean, when I had it on the mini, it was running with less issue. I said that old guy keeps running into you. Like I think he does it on purpose. I think he's like magnetized to you or something. I almost did that last night. I was really mad last night about this. And I went to Steam to price it. And I don't want to pay $20 Canadian for it. It'd probably be like $15 to you. Yeah, that's what I thought. I don't know, it just... I mean, don't get me wrong, the game was worth that lots more back in the day, but I'm being cheap. <laughs> Can't say I have. This is Deku the Gay. Oh. to go see that rock and roll band. Just between us, I heard the king is distressed over over his tomboy daughter. Just once, I would like to see how wild she really is. <laughs> I'm sure you would, lady. I'm sure you would. clinging to me. See now, I was going to do this a different way too. I, well, I wrote it in, in Discord how I was thinking of doing this. He wants my booty, yeah? He does. And I don't blame him. <laughs> <laughs>
Who's gonna win? Oh, the cat didn't finish. Oh, we put 20 silver points on my card. Not that I need them now. <laughs> he wants the man booty. <laughs> I should buy that for him, shouldn't I? Ah, he can bite me. Hold your horses, I want to buy some candy. She wants some candy. I bet you Aerith is somewhere in the area. The way you talked about Aerith's backdoor dealings. <laughs> She's looking for candy, maybe she got some. <laughs> <laughs> I know, right? I'm starting to wonder if she sells more than the medical stuff or medicinal stuff. Heavens, we won't talk about it. Let's just say last night's stream was a bust. So tonight I'm starting over, and I'm late starting. I've only been streaming for 28 minutes, and most of that was actually talking to Deku. There were some technical difficulties last night. Saving wouldn't have helped. Not at that point. Let's just say this game didn't want me to play it last night. 
You guys so mad? I literally pulled the tonight. I actually pulled the disc out. So I'm using my original PS1 disc on in my PS3. Roger. More, more, give me more. Roger. There, we did it. Follow you after I know what went wrong. Good luck, Chrono. I was playing this on the PS1 Mini last night. And I pulled the controller a little too hard to when I was moving around. And it jolted the power adapter and back of the PS1 Mini and crashed my game. So yeah, that was the thing. And I wasn't even gonna- I was, almost gave up on this game completely. Well, I didn't get far enough to what really have a file. I, I wasn't much further than this. I was in the forest on the way to the castle. wasn't one simple thing. I was already late last night as it was. And I was like, I'm not taking that chance again. So I pulled my disc out tonight and put it in the PS3 and here I am. Unfortunately with the disc, as you can tell, unlike the PS1 Mini, which everything's directly on a hard drive, there's a little bit of loading time in between things. Which is kind of annoying, but it's not bad enough that it's unbearable. I almost bought the PC version until I seen it was 20 bucks. I wasn't paying twenty dollars for something this old. I'm too cheap for that. In here. I don't think there is anything else, but... Nope. Uh... <laughs> I actually almost streamed the remake to Secret of Mana tonight instead. Shopping. Okay, I only got five hundred, and I'd rather Oh yeah, Secret of Man will be good. I, I, I really like how they did the remake. If 
back in the day, it had a lot of glitches when it first started, but I hear they cleaned a lot of that up. game <laughs> eventually one day this game will lead me to finally sucking it up and playing Chrono Cross because back in the day I just did not enjoy Chrono Cross enough to play through it I just I didn't even bother finishing it Everybody's like, oh, screwed across this, screwed across that. And I'm just like, eh, whatever. <laughs> Even my little my little woman played, she actually played through Chrono Cross and loved it. And I'm just like, yeah. <laughs> Wait, I thought you played this game, Heavens. Just kidding. Okay, never mind. Yeah, all right. I get it. Enjoy your show. <laughs> and it's not that it was that bad. I just I didn't feel motivated to play it, Deku. I really didn't. So maybe it'll be a whole different story nowadays. Because you know I didn't like Final Fantasy XII back in the day either. And I played the PS4 version here on my own a little bit before I actually started streaming. And I actually enjoyed it. It still wasn't amazing, but it was a good game at the same time. They're on balls! So you're having a mellow night, Deku? You know, a lot of people don't understand that even doing things online like that, it can take it out of you. Mentally, anyway. At least I think it's that way. <laughs> the chug might have made it a little harder on you, too. <laughs> Dude, I can go buy that sword now. Or I think I can. That way's kind of draining, because... I'd rather be gaming with it. It's just like being in school. 
you, you, you worry about what they think of your answers, what they think of your your skills. It, it's similar in a lot of ways. It's roly poly. I'm gonna do a little bit of running back and forth here. I just wanna buy that other sword. Actually, I'm not even sure I wanna buy that other sword. I think I just wanna get my. I, I wanna get my HP back by going to the inn again. Trading course. Oh, CPR is a good thing to have, even for for any job. Honestly, looks good on a resume. That is a bit of a, a time... Like, they're not giving you a whole lot of time to do that. Oh, really? You couldn't have critical them the first time. Coming employed. <laughs> it's like in this day and age, it doesn't even matter what it's employed, as long as it's employed. But I'm glad you're getting to do something that you might enjoy doing more. <laughs> I'm already employed. Oh, it's it's employment tra yeah, you get paid training too. Right? Is that what you're saying? Pretty sweet. Oh, sweet it is. 
Ugh, I watch too much anime. You really have to watch the show, Ranma. There's quite a bit of it. <laughs> I think there's like seven seasons at like 20 some episodes a season. Just need to find it on something, that's all. <laughs> For some reason it's not on streaming or on Crunchyroll. Yes, but my anime is the most importantest. <laughs> I didn't see it there. Maybe it is. Um, what was that? Oh. I I'm guessing you haven't had time to tang. <laughs> Now I wonder if that if it's on Funimation, I wonder how much editing they did to it. Funimation used to do anime uh, VHS tapes back in the day, before streaming was a thing because there was no internet, and uh, they edited the crap out of some of it. Alt, who goes there? Check out that hair. Where are you from, son? Are you one of Magus's troopers? Hardly. This kid would never have made the cut. Show us your stamp collection, son. Arr, now be it, shrimp. Stop that at once. Be lean. Show your manners. This is a friend of mine. But there's something odd about him. refuse to obey my orders? Forgive me, my lady. Please enter, sir. <laughs> no <taking. laughs> Remember two weeks ago when I said I was gonna watch it? <laughs> yeah. I remember you quite a few times gonna watch it. <laughs> no, I won't go that far. <laughs> but you're missing out. We'll see. In about a month's time, I'll remind you. You'll be like, Oh no, I forget again. <laughs> ah, there you are. Please leave us. I need to talk to this individual. Certainly, Your Highness. Come near, sir.
Hee hee. Hee type F or declare F on stream. <laughs> you will. You will. Fooled you, didn't I, Chrono? It's me, but everyone calls me lean. So, I'm so relieved you're here. We barely know each other, but somehow I knew you'd come for me. Thank you, Chrono. Something's wrong. What's happening? I feel like I'm being torn apart. Eee. Help me, Chrono. I'm scared. Please, Chrono, help me. Zoom. And she exploded into millions of pieces. I know, right? Oh no! Huff oh, huff! I had to fall on my knees so I look cute laying down like this. Yeah! <laughs> huff puff! Oh, puff puff! <laughs> You're okay. Did you find the girl? Gone? What do you mean she's gone? Hmm, just as I thought. I knew I recognized her. And this looks identical to the castle in our time. I bet they mistook the girl for her ancestor. You see, she's a member of the royal family in our time. She's Princess Nadia. <laughs> what? Meryl, that is Princess Nadia, is a descendant of Queen Lean. Because Queen Lean ate lean beef. <laughs> I guess. Queen Lean has been kidnapped. As I recall, someone was supposed to have saved her. The history has been changed. <gasps> Gasp. Mira looks so much like Lean that they probably called off their search when she appeared here. But if the real queen is killed... No! Mira will simply disappear. There might still be time. If we can save Lean, history, will... history as we know it should remain unchanged. Oh, I'll change it. I'll change it all! Something must have happened to the Queen in this era. As a result, Princess Nadia ceases to exist. Hurry, we have to find the real Queen. Do, 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 do.
I got a girl with a pew pew gun. It's awesome. Uh oh. Being attacked by birds. Don't let them shit on your head. When's the next time we should expect Deku to uh, be Mario with finishing Mario? You did not hear Pew Pew cut. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear, it looks like you could use some food and a place to rest. What did you find? A hairpin. That's Guardia's royal crest. Are you ready for it? Would slow? He's already slow enough right now. Ding. Oh, you might clear it. I mean, you've only got the Clock World and Rainbow Land. To pretty much finishing it. The secret stars are basically the toads that have stars. Those are the secret stars. And, and, like, I mean, I think there's, like, two or three hidden walls with, like, one star missions in them. Well, you're almost done the clock plays. That's not that bad. The coins is what's going to kill your time. That'll always kill your time. But actually, if I remember right, the hundred coins in the re in in Rainbow Land is actually not that bad. Called two. That's my guess. Oh, we learned an ability. Hot damn. 
Phew, that was close. Ah. Froggy! Lower thine guard, and thou art allowing the enemy in. Thou art here to save the queen. The lair is deep within. Will you accompany me? Uh, a frog. Bruno, it's Taco Frog. I hate frogs. The guest doth not incur thy trust. Very well, do as you please, but I shall save the queen. Wait. You don't seem like a bad, uh, er, person frog thing. I mean... Yeah. Bruno, what should we do? Go with the frog. Of course, always go with the frog. I just have to handle it. I mean, deal with him. What's your name? Slippy! Got it. <laughs> His name is Frog. <laughs> Frog will do. And then he flexes a muscle. I know it's not always easy to tell when that what it looks like in a digital form like that and pixelated, but he is flexing his arm. I have a hidden door, lurks and I. Let us search the end. Yep, yeah, but game. Your hidden door can wait. My health is so low, it's not even funny. I know, it was bigger than his head. He was compensating for something. Maybe I should buy some shit for them too. And I'm broke again. <laughs> I bought her a dart gun. Board game? Deku, did you order another board game? Didn't you have like a crazy little... What was it? You told me about a board game you had with like some crazy ass pieces. It might have been a Kingdom Hearts one. No, wait. Nah, I can't even remember anymore.
<laughs> Makes sense. What board game did you order this time? So cool. <laughs> I want to play a Metal Gear board game. But I think if I showed it to anyone around here, I'd get laughed at. I got a. I actually do have quite the little collection of board games, but they're kids' board games, and some some old board games that I kind of grew up with myself. But they're nothing advanced by any means. the bromide. Bromide? Get them! Get them, boys! his updates and just now they sent Marvel to my old apartment and I had to rush back to get it before somebody stole it. <laughs> and lastly I have a board game centered around Batman the animated series. Oh god. I think Frosty you said he like used to like that show. They sound neat, Deku.
I wish I had some friends that were into weird board games. <laughs> it would be cool, though. Maybe, like, digital versions. <laughs> they, uh, what, what can I say? What was that called? I actually like that they've been doing a lot of, like, hold on, a lot of older, old school... Uh, let's see, a lot of old school board games they've been doing digitally. And I think, I think that's kind of neat. I really do. I, I, I'm happy to see that stuff. However, the reason I brought that up is because on the Nintendo Switch, I have something called Clubhouse Games, which is like a whole crap ton of board games and stuff. And <laughs> that's something, the little woman wanted it. But I kind of wanted it too, so I can't lie. <laughs> Tabletop simulator? Never heard of it. Keep in mind, I've never really played any advanced board games. So, I would be a complete noob to some of these. But it's always sounded fun to me. Burb, hey, what's with the disguises? No need for them here. It's almost my shift. I hate pretending to be human. It's so repulsive. Burp. The ones we ate recently weren't so bad. And those two soldiers we caught look rather plump and juicy. Yark is so smart. His plan to capture the Chancellor and take his place worked perfectly. Now the queen's captive and the castle's in an uproar. This is rich. Look, one of Mag I I'll look in on Magus' statue before my shift. Name implies just a sim. Hold on. Oh, dearest Magus, your flashing eyes like stars and flowery, flowing air, like weaves atop of a sea. No sad, sunny day nor any frightful, bright place can get us down. As long as you're near, there's nothing to fear. Worshipping the statue. So do you need the actual board game or you or is this something that has the board game built into it, kind of like it is the game. 
Because I could picture people playing if they both had the same board game and just kind of like camming it back and forth saying, my piece moves here. It sounds kind of weird, but, you know. Okay. I'm nice of you to come. I'm sure Yarko, Yakra will be just as pleased. Why not rest in here until he's available? them attack me. Let's do some magic it. Come on. I need her to be her power bar to be up first. they're close enough together. It should wipe over the moat. The bundles of humbles. Learn some shit. Good frog. I think I ended up with a Warhammer game a long time ago on a Humble Bundle when I was trying for another game. It was a Humble Bundle that had something I wanted in it, and the Warhammer game came with it. I don't remember which game it was, though. I have to check my Steam someday just to figure out what it was. Humans? They're hiding the queen in the back. Please rescue her. Inside the building, there's a room dedicated to Magus. There's something about treasure there. <laughs> well, I've already taken treasure.
I wonder if it would be a smart thing to leave this place, get my health back, save all the progress I did. Eh, maybe I'll just wing it. Maybe there's a save in here somewhere. Stop, intruders! Gag! If you get close enough together, I'll tech combo. You guys reuse whirlwind kick. Diablos. I'm really thinking about heading in. Ah, there's a thing. Save point. Probably don't have it. Okay, game. Organize! Oh crap, I was supposed to hit save, not...
Ooh. The bat's just annoying to hit. I got a shelter. I can use that shelter. But I will clear up this middle part first before I do, because I'm pretty sure there's a boss in this area. A boss ish. We love when you level. Can't be a better sword already, can it? Oh, better for him. That I can deal with. I learned all of the things. Welcome back. I hope you didn't fall in. It could be a messy trip. <laughs> Oh, 
What do you mean, not you? You could stumble home drunk some night. No, like, I think I'll step in the toilet. <laughs> boy. <laughs> Exactly. I knew it was a hazard point. I have all of the points. Damn it, didn't kill him. Ugh, oh, really? Oh, wow. Wait, why is there a save point that close? I mean... It was, what, there was just one, uh, oh, forget it. There was just one a second ago. Prepare yourself, Queen Lean. You, how did you get in here? Frog! Majesty, stand back and allow us the honor. Be careful. He has a mean hairdo. It's useless to fight. No one will leave here alive. Stupid frog, it's time for you to jump off the mortal coil. True form change! Power Ranger! The ugly ass Power Ranger! <laughs> Reverse the Yakra! Ow! <gasps> <clears throat> He's like, brum. Thank you. 
Diggity dog. When fifty experience seemed like a lot. You came to rescue me. Thank you, Frog. The king awaits. Let us return to the castle. Thank thee, Chrono, and Lucia. Dean, yes, thank you so much. Please join us. You're not treasure! Those chops are phew. Thank you. That monster stuffed me in there. Oh, your highness. As you can see, I am undamaged. Return to the castle. Sure. Give me no options. You had me worried, Lean. That no good Yakra impersonating me and kidnapping the Queen. We must create a criminal justice system in this kingdom to do away with such fiends. Failed to protect Queen Lean. I have disgraced thee. Frog! Dun 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 dun. The timing was perfect. Who knew what would have happened if you didn't save me? By the way, where is the girl who was mistaken for me? Oh, yeah, I forgot about her. Oh no, where did Princess Nadia disappear? She may still be there. Twas a fault of mine which endangered the Queen. I shall depart for good. Oh no, you have potential to be a good swordsman. Damn right I do. Froggy, you weren't such a bad guy either. Oh, he was. How can I say this nicely? Froggerific. The queen just wanted to get a frog stuck in her throat. Seven Deku. Huh? What happened? Princess Nadia. Chrono? It was awful. I can't recall it at all it at all. I was somewhere cold, dark, and lonely. Is that what it's like to die? Welcome back, Princess Nadia. You risked your life to help me too? Princess Nadia. Oh ho. Uh oh. <laughs> I guess you guys figured it out, huh? Sorry, Chrono. I didn't mean to deceive you. I'm Princess Nadia. My father's king. Guardia. The uh, XXXIII. So he's the third porn star of the world. <laughs> 
I really enjoyed being with you at the fair. But if you know known my identity, Chrono, would you have shown me around the fair anyway? Chrono, you wouldn't have showed me around the fair, right? Wrong. Vinzy jolts awake, screaming, "Stop that!" <laughs> The real queen saves it. Let's go home, Chrono. What was awful? <laughs> uh. You're the real queen lean, huh? You really could be my twin. Well, you two better get along, or I'll be in big trouble. I'll keep my fingers crossed. Oh, the <laughs> Yes! Excuse me. Um, never mind. I guess it's time to go. Like hell, I'm letting you get away without letting me save, game. I have to save, because since I'm not using the PS1 Mini, save states are not a thing. And the Mini would bypass all the uh, that little loading. <laughs> uh, but this is actually reading it from a disc, so that's a thing, too. Actually, do I have any gear for her? Probably not. I gave it to the other girl, probably. Uh. <laughs> ah, that'll do. That'll do, donkey. That'll do. Pew pew. He was a master hot dog eater at one time. That's how he became the third of that kind. <laughs> That frog made it across by swimming to the other side. Really? Who knew a frog could swim? I think Aura is Cure. Which is 
kind of sweet. That's one way to start a battle with record scratch. What? scratch before the last battle. Oh. Maybe I didn't hear something. Who's the use level up? Yay! How do we get home? or princess we please call me Meryl well then Meryl observe whoa Lucy you're amazing ain't it the truth oh um I mean enough with the false modesty you have a real gift I would trade my royal ancestry for your genius in a heartbeat well, if you say so. Anyway, I call this thing a gate. It's kind of a portal that takes you to the same location in a different era. Gates are very unstable, so I use the principle behind my telepod device. We create the gate key. Now we can use them as we please. But why did this gate suddenly appear? Either the telepod had something to do with it, or something else made it. This is getting pretty weird. Let's at least head back to our home time. Alright, coming, Bruno? <laughs> Don't forget to bring a towel! back. A dinosaur story. Bruno, Lucia, why don't you come with me to the castle? I'd like you to come over for dinner. Sorry for putting you through all that, Meryl. Are you joking? That's the most fun I've had in months. I have some new friends, too. Bruno, be a gentleman and take her home. I've got some work to do. See you soon, Lucia. Will you escort me home, Chrono? Like I have a choice, if I want the story to progress. up to join you and your party again just to trip back into the <laughs> Grotto's house I've only seen you with Lucia. Who's your pretty new friend? Hi, I'm Meryl. Uh, Meryl? Never seen you before, dear. 
Where, I know I've seen you before, dear. Where was that? Hello. Alright, we're leaving. We're leaving the house. And we're never coming back. Till we feel like it. <laughs> like how that whole section there is just gone. There used to be that monastery there where they hit her. Killer mushrooms from Mars. Oh. You eventually get to a point where you don't lose her so much. <laughs> The bird rang a bell! Everybody run! Like dinner time, boys. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't say they were spiders. They looked more like... Uh, that says beetles up there, so I guess beetles. I don't even think they look like beetles, to be honest. Princess Nadia! Are you alright? Where have you been? I heard you were abducted. We had soldiers searching for you. Scoundrel, you're the one, huh? Kidnapping Princess Nadia? No, Kronos? Admit it. You confused her and tried to take over the throne. Terrorist! <laughs> Stop it! Up this at once. What are you doing? The Princess Nadia said to Idiots, detain him. And they tackled me. And her hair just went crazy. This is where you find out everybody's against you. Oh! I'm the Chancellor. Er, Chancellor. The Prosecutor. I'm the Lawyer. The Heir. Members of the Court. We now bring forth the defendant, Chrono, who is charged with abducting Princess Nadia. Which. I mean, she's back in the castle? <laughs> what shall we do with him? Fire, perhaps? Hang him upside down for a few years? Or shall we empty the guillotine? Or employ the guillotine? You, the jury, shall decide his fate. Now let us begin. Chrono, you are here by order to tell the truth. Chrono. Chrono is charged with a uh, premeditated abduction of royalty. The question is, did he kidnap Princess Nadia? The answer? No, he did not. In fact, no abduction took place. The two met completely by accident. In fact, Princess asked Chrono if she could join him. Is this true? Who actually started this whole mess? 
Are you sure? We have witnesses who will say you were the one who bumped into the princess. Hey! Ouch, that hurt. The princess then innocently followed you to Lucia's little side show, whereupon you both disappeared. If that wasn't criminal abduction, I don't know what is. It sounds like they were getting it on for young folks. <laughs> and I have facts to throw the defendant's character into question. Objection. This can't have any relevance whatsoever to this case. Care to respond, Chancellor? Proto's character is at the very core of this case. We have nothing to hide. We have a witness, a little girl who will vote for the character of this defendant. When you're hung upside down for a few years, you would be dead, so why would you just not just use the guilty? Because he likes to torture. This nice man, he brought me my kitty. <laughs> Thank you for being so kind. How about that? Doesn't this young man deserve a medal? Looks like they're buying it. <laughs> what the hell? The issue here is motive. Was there any motive for this fine citizen to kidnap Princess Nadia? No, there was not. What about Ransom? Chrono, her fortune did not tempt you? Her, her fortune did tempt you, did it not? Are you sure? You really weren't tempted? Not at all, because I didn't even know she was rich. That's enough. I have no more questions. It is evident that my client is a fine, noble young man, Your Honor. The defense rests. He rescued a cat. Obviously, he's a good person, which he's innocent. Only that was how the system worked. I know, right? Members of the jury. He is guilty. Stand to the left of innocent. If innocent. Stand to the right. Not guilty. Not guilty. Wait till you hear the ones that say I am guilty. Okay, I've never had I've never had them all say I wasn't guilty. Guilty. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Order in the court. Verdict has been reached. Verdict is not guilty. But the fact remains that the event if he Remains that even if he did not kidnap her, he ran off with her. Three days solitary confinement as punishment. Take him away. But just a darn minute. Princess. That's enough, my dear. Father, all I asked was for you to behave like a princess. Even royalty must obey rules. Leave the rest up to the Chancellor. And forget about the events in town. We're leaving. Oh no! Not guilty, but you still go to jail. Sounds like the actual court system. <laughs> yes! Game still looks good for being an old SNES style game. It would have been a little sharper if I got the PC version, though. They're just too cheap! <laughs> this terrorist has tried to overthrow our kingdom. Yes. <laughs> He's been found guilty and must, must now carry out his sentence. 
So this is the monster who kidnapped the princess. The execution is in three days away. Do not let him get out of your sight. Execution? Strange, but I don't seem to recall hearing anything about an execution. What? How dare you question me? Paperwork's probably just been held up in the system. Understood, sir. Guards. Yeah, I know, right? It doesn't matter if you... Like, if you don't do... If, even if you got everybody to say not guilty, this is still how it ends up going. Take the prisoner away. Just a little bump. Some sympath sympathizers brought that stuff for you, you lousy felon. Six ethers. It's almost like why bother? I didn't figure it had something to do with getting good ending. You put it. You feel you lousy felt. Yeah. Uh, I don't think that part has anything to do with the ending. I think it just... The story it twists itself a little bit and goes different ways. Like, you, you, you just get to see different little events throughout the game. Wipe down! What if I don't wanna? What are you gonna do about it? Knock it off. Oh, I'll show him. Open it up. Oh, check this out. Check this out. <laughs> the guard beating the snot out of me. Just like real life. That's what you get for misbehaving. And then we knock the guard out. Where do you think you're going? Ten experience. <gasps> oh, Timmy Chow. I want to feed my enemy. Ha. Huh? <laughs> what are you up to? Um, about five nine, five ten ish. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Treasure! 
Empty now. Well, it is now. They don't pay me enough for this. <laughs> They were pretty uh, messed up looking, so it had it coming. See. Oh, come on. That sucks. <laughs> the other way. Prisoners escaping. <laughs> I'm only doing this for the jail scene, but it works. I think you'd love it if I did. <laughs> <laughs> it's weird. So, 
I've actually been told that you can get something like the equivalent of a stream deck, but as a digital app for your phone. That would kind of be fun in a situation like this. But you know what a stream deck is, right? Like, the thing that Elgato makes? Little programmable physical buttons that you can make it do maybe your sound effects or make pop-ups and have them, like, one-touch button. Uh, you can also use it to change scenes in your video. You can do it all with your mouse, it's just convenient to do it like this. Like, you can program it to take, um, it could, you, like, you use your camera. Um, you could push it when you just want to talk and pause the game, and you push one, you program it one button to push it that, uh, your cam goes full screen over top of your, your game. Help me! You probably will. That you just saved a mass murderer. I'm Fritz. My dad runs the store in Truce Village. Stop by if you're in the area. It's basically just a set of buttons that you can hold in your hand and push whenever you want and program them to pretty much do anything you want. But you, like I said, it's all stuff you can do with your mouse and just clicking. I was a little late on that one. But it's cool enough that it's, it's a time saver, I guess. You can get them, you can get small ones and you can get really big ones. However, I, like I said, I hear that there's apps for your phone they can do the same thing. That have like uh, they have free versions and like demo ver or like full versions that will let you add more buttons, I guess. Yeah, exactly. Less work isn't bad. They look strange as shit. I can't help it. <laughs> that gets the nanny. Nani? how we get that item in that cell that was next door to you. But 
the shelter. Spider Chrono? Yeah. Gills! A load sword. <laughs> it took a load to get that sword. Yay! Of course you can't finish opening that damn door. Otherwise you could just go over and restore your health with a drink that's on the side. The prisoner's escaping. Run away! <laughs> it looked like they were running. I can't help it. Chrono, Spider Chrono, does whatever Spider Chrono can. Help! <laughs> Hello, I broke into prison. Chrono, I've come to save you. Gee, it looks like you didn't need my help after all. Let's blow this joint. That's what she said. Top secret document has been left on the floor. Here to read it? Damn right I do. To the prison supervisor. Dragon tank owner's manual. The tank head repairs the body damage. It contains a shield that prevents damage by lightning and fire. Unless the head can be defeated, the tank is unbeatable. Guard R&D. Yeah, he might get in a little trouble. <laughs> but who cares? <laughs> I'm going to do a combo sound effect for this. Well, he does look rather not there. Like, you know, you can only really, in real life, be unconscious for so long. What was that? It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. For the target tech, crush those rebels. Yeah. 
I know I should heal. That was more important. It's not looking good. What was the oh thank god. You just had to do that. Pick up the dragon tank, fix it quickly! Look, you go I know, right? Let's walk over them. Don't fool yourselves into thinking you've gotten away with this. Oh, I am a fool. I like how they don't attack you, they just kind of try to run into you. <laughs> no choice but to break through! They're escaping! Nadia. I am sick of this shit. <laughs> this is my friend. Show him your respect. But can't you take orders? Of course. Hold it right there. Who is the king Gurdia Horn three says? Father? Silence, Princess Nadia. The throne comes before your personal wishes. What, just because I have a title doesn't mean I'm not a person? You pick up strange ideas venturing outside. I didn't pick up anything. It's called common sense. Princess Nadia, I despise you. I'm leaving. Princess Nadia. 
Come on, Chrono. Don't just stand there after them. Princess Nadia. They're there, don't lose them. There's no escape. Silence. Oh, there's always escape. <laughs> oh, <laughs> you getting three more days of solitaire now. <laughs> as long as it's the card game solitaire, that's all that matters. Looks like a dead end. A gate? Come on. But we don't know where it'll take us. Who cares? This place stinks anyway. Princess Nadia! This is completely irrational. Hurry, Chrono! <laughs> Listen, that sounds more like hell, Deku. <laughs> Quick into the possibly deadly time hole. Exactly, Frosty. You know how it works. That's the only choice to do. Wow. Eek. Youch. She patted her booty. I'm so excited. <laughs> There's no way the Chancellor can reach us here. But, where are we? The civilization here seems so advanced. Like, we're in another world. Like, you may be right. <laughs> oh, like, totally tubular, dude. <laughs> Could be worse, could be stuck with stuck you with a real life Kingdom Hearts trading card game. <sighs> Got any cash? Yes. All this money? Oh well, I have some good stuff. <laughs> Your money's crap. What the hell is this? Ooh. going to be an expensive trip. have a bow for her. Seems to have some high prices for someone who doesn't know if it's money or not. Inflation is crazy in the future, I guess. Yes, yes it is. So, Frosty, I had to do something I didn't want to do. Save money. It'll do you good. That's my motto. Um, I had to dig out my original copy CD of the game. It's 
so there's going to be, you, you'll notice the loading times, like when I had the PS1 Mini on, I just wasn't, I wasn't taking the chance of screwing that up again, because of one little tug and I, I couldn't find my other charging cables to use on it, otherwise I would have just put a good one on, but when I couldn't find one, I was like, screw it, I'll get the disc out and put it in the PS3. Problem is, now you can actually feel the loading because it is coming from a disc. On the Mini, there was a lot less loading. Like, it was it was quicker, it was less noticeable. Yeah, you're probably right about that too, Deku. I'll find some food in Aris Dome to the northwest, but only if you get past Lab 16 beasts there don't react to weapons like guns and swords. True Stone? Never heard of it. This is Tran Dome. If you're looking for food, you lose. Kingdom? What are you talking about? This is an Enertron. You get a full night's sleep in a few seconds, but it still leaves you hungry. A strange crust. Wait, this is where I came out of, right? Well, he's... You're well rested before you die of hunger. Exactly. And that is the battle. That's just how it goes, boys. And girls. And aliens and boogers and uh <laughs> Wow, wow, wow. Deku had the uh, bright idea that it would be funny to use the Metal Gear alert system every so every time something attacked me in the prison. <laughs> so I did it. It was weird. It worked though. Wow. See, I'm sorry. If we were in a situation like this in the world where there was nothing to, nothing to eat and monsters everywhere, I would just eat the monsters. could still chew on that. Better than nothing. <gasps> you dirty rat! Stop stealing my tonics! Can't you kill them?
really. It didn't kill their ass. Meat eater. <laughs> That's almost as bad as the frog stuck in her throat. Uh... I give up. I'm never gonna have any tonics left by the end of this map. Thankfully, the one girl can heal. Which I don't need yet. Oh. That was a very nice game. Forget it. Kill him. He is a dick. Who likes to heal the other enemies? Imagine running out of ideas for your monster's name so you just called him Meteor. Only worse than that. Because it's better. Uh, Meat eater. Deku! Beef eater! <laughs> Tell me you forgot that song. <laughs> oh, that's not good. All right, Frosty. So, <laughs> um, Deku is going to come up with a Metal Gear themed song <laughs> for meat eaters. <laughs> it was kind of to go along with a barbecue sauce. It was a very interesting. Oh yeah, by all means, Deku, just go along with it. I may have ruined some of the surprise to it by now, but... I've seen your message too late. But yes, f fill him in on the details. Because I don't remember how it started to begin with. But I do remember it, the conversation of it.
They look like little mini volcanoes. They are little mini volcanoes. His dad not only likes to barbecue, his dad makes barbecue sauce. It, it's pretty sweet. Like I, I'm actually thinking of ordering one just to try it out someday. I like all of the barbecue sauces. But Deku, if you could pull this song off, you could like literally pitch it to your dad like, can you put this as a theme song for a commercial or something? <laughs> the words would be totally different. <laughs> wow, wow. Neither what the rat's probably gonna steal from me anyway. Shit. <laughs> he wouldn't understand the Snake Eater reference. He's like, now dad, you have to play this game or it won't work. <laughs> oh, come on. before I get out of here. I think it could totally work. It needs to happen. Wee.
Give me free rations! Rations! to the west. What? Hey, we've got people who cross the ruins. Hey, again? You're joking. So there are people who can beat up those freaky mutants. Pardon me. I'm Don. I'm the descendant of the director of this info center. In the basement, there's a huge computer and a storage center for food. But we can't get there or get through because the robot guards. It, it's a pity. Well, did you really come from the Dome to the West? Yes, I did. I see. Not that I really care. <laughs> You can reach the continent to the south through the sewer access, but stay off the Death Peak. The door with the crest. Dynamite won't budge it. The dynamite works on everything! I'd love to do a parody song, but I never turn this before. <laughs> hey, no, you know what? That's a start. You just gotta kind of have, I say, the instrumental part of the song playing without words, and then you try to fill in the blanks from there. Sure, this is money. Oh well, I have a I have to lighten my inventory anyway. Bye. Nope. 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 <sighs> I have two tonics to my name. started for me. I feel like I need to look at the original lyrics to get the feel for them. Yeah, but you pretty much, I mean, you probably know the words in your head. Yeah, Frosty likes to write things. But he would need to know a basic idea of what you were looking to figure out. Are you going down below? Of course. But no one's ever returned from there. Gotta try, right? 
It's nice to see such spirited young people for a change. Careful now, and come back alive. Oh, Billy. Looks like a statue. A memo is attached to it. Warning, anyone within the vicinity of the stock room will be attacked. Executing program. Bruno, Meryl, what's going on? Meryl, let's go. This could be my first death of the night. But I mean, we'll see. It revived bits. If the bits are alive and you attack the main body, it counterattacks everything you do. A 
Breakdown! Break dance. Do that all of the experience. Phew, something reeks. Everything's completely rotten. The refrigerator must have failed. Oh no, look! Passed away a long time ago, I suppose. It's holding something. What do you suppose it is? Looks like some kind of seed. Seed? You suppose it could grow in a place like this? Following is written on the soiled sheet of paper. The rat is more than just a statue. It knows the secret of this dome. Catch it. Have to catch the rat. So much for it just might die here. <laughs> there, there it is. Shh. Dash with circle to catch him. Catch his ass. Got it! Squeak, I give up. I'll tell you everything. Squeak. Press and hold the L1 and R1 buttons. And then press X button to access the secret passage, Squeak. Don't make any mistakes or you'll be sorry. Let's see. I'll be sorry. All right. It was the password. I can take revenge on the rats. Stealing all my damn tonics. Beatles again, Deku. Beatles with long necks. <laughs> Those totally not spiders. <laughs> Yeah, they're totally not spiders.
Finish off this area. Well, this underground spot. Get the little cutscene, head out, save, and then I'll probably call for the night. I'll probably be a few minutes over my normal cutoff time, but I started really late anyway. So this is the info center? Good, the computer's still operational. If we run a search on time warps, we might find their gate. Of course she knows how to use this computer. Yeah, here, got it. East of Aris Dome. Wow, wow. I could make better, better noises. Oh, I see. That would be Protodome. That would be Protodome, I believe. Leave it to Lucia. I'm beginning to think you could find anything with this device. Say, what does this button do? <laughs> Blue screen! <laughs> Lucia, 1999 AD, visual record of the day of Lavos. Mm. Boom, boom. I will shoot my rainy death on you. And blue screen. <laughs> We must truly be in the future. No, no way. I refuse to believe it. This... This can't be the way the world ends. Well, it kind of didn't end, but it did. Chrono. There's only one thing we can do. We must change history. Just like Chrono did when he saved me. Hey, Lucia? Hey, Chrono? Um, you want me to beat up a world-ending monster? <laughs> I guess so. It was a stroke of luck that we were sent here through that gate. Chrono, let's go. Okay! Chrono, Lucia, together we can do this. Let's take a second and do some more research on Lavos. Activities back... Er, Lavos' activities back in our time period. Next up, Protodome. Aw, oh, yeah.
can't go in that door anyway. Not yet, anyway. I don't see anything up here to make this spot actually worth going to. I mean, I get it when I have to come back for that other door, but... But, like, here I don't see no... any chest or nothing. Did you discover this is our future? Who cares? Where's the food? This is all we could get. Seeds. Don't know how long the end or I keep messing up that word. Enertrons will hold out. Yeah, you don't know how long the enertrons will hold out. Those seeds might be your only hope. You have to stay alive, and so do we. Huh. You're strange. You're different from us. I think it's because we're healthy. Healthy? Got a nice ring to it. Well, or will they grow the seed? We'll try growing the seeds. What are those? It just might be our future. Heading for Protodome? Go by way of the Laboratory 32 and take this with you. A bike key. It's a key to the jet bike in Lab 32. I used to ride it when I was young. Hope it still works. They've got more powerful robots over there. Take care and stay healthy. This is where I'm calling it for the night. Did I go past? Oh, I'm right on time, I guess. So, I mean, I had 
a few different plans. I, I didn't want a chance doing the PS1 Mini again. I, I wish I could have because of the, the extra, you know, the less loading between battles and stuff like that. But that's fine. I was going to do... I, w I looked into the Steam version. I'm not paying $20 Canadian for the Steam version. Um, I was going to do the DS version on an emulator. And my internet decided to crash when I did it. And I was like, this is a bad sign. Like, I I'm just about to give up on this game eternally. I'm like, I wonder if I can find my disc. And I rooted, and I rooted while the internet was down. And I found my original disc. And I put that, and I turned on my PS3, plopped it in, and loaded up just fine. But I still have to deal with that little downside of the... It's not bad loading, it's just, you know, if you're used to the original game, it wasn't there before. Uh, wait a uh, what's a minute right? <laughs> is that what you try? Is that what you tried to do this morning? What the? Oh yeah, yeah. I was popping up the DS version, and it would have worked too. But it would have been a little weird. I wasn't going to use the two screens. I was going to set it up that you guys would only see the top screen where the game was. But even when you set it in the classic mode, there's things you miss out on on the bottom. And I wish I could have did it. Oh, I mean, I could have done it. But I was getting kind of annoyed and uh, thinking a little bit uh, irrationally. <laughs> like I do. <laughs> And, yeah, I was like, yeah, let's go look and see if I can find my disc. And I found it, and, yeah, here I am. I'm on a PS3 then. But, on the bonus side of that, the PS3's full-screen, uh, higher-scale resolution with the stretching actually looks fine. Doesn't look bad. Doesn't look like total ass. It really doesn't. So, there is that. Anyway, have a good night. Thanks for showing up. And I'll be back again tomorrow. Later!